So, uh, Assam Tourism Department has been the talk of the town. And when we talk of the hordes of tourists, uh, tourists coming to the state, we are always talking about the Kaziranga or the Kamaikya. What about the hordes of tourists for the other part? It's not like that. Kamaikha and Kaziranga are no doubt our strong point. And I always believe that we should make our strong point more stronger. You know, this is for everyone. Kahin ye tourism ka rahe, koi study mein bhi aapka agar match mein you are more, uh, have a command, so aap usme jada mehnat karte, right? You will work hard on that. Or koi somebody is good in science, so he definitely try to get more marks in 10th. Our strongest point, strong points are Kamaikha and Kaziranga. Why not we do more publicity on that? We should try for that. But the, if you see the statistics, statistics mein agar dekhenge, last year we had a tremendous growth in tourism footfall in Assam, right? And this year, man, last financial year also, there is significant growth. 70, 80 lakhs ke tourists in ka visit kiya hai Assam mein. And if you see the statistics, it is not confining only to Kamekha and Kaziranga. No doubt, we have a significant numbers, but people visit other place also. People visited Manas, people visited uh, uh, Jorhat, Dekya Khwanamghar, people visited Sivsagar, Karinghar, Ranghar. So, it is spread across Assam. So, Kaziranga no doubt had a footfall. This is record footfall this time. But the total, if you see the statistics that, that we collected, department collected, that is the tourist footfall spread across the south. So, it is not confined to that. Right? So, it is, I do not agree with that. We are just confining to that. And a lot of efforts are being uh, uh, carried out. We are, uh, we are underway different initiative to make various places where we have potential to make them a tourism hotspots. It is beyond Kaziranga or beyond Kamaikha temple, right? We have created infrastructure in Batadwa town. That is one of the known epitome of Assamese best nomad culture. That is already redevelopment has been done. Ronghor, if you see the redevelopment process already started for the government, that is a mega redevelopment program. Uh, Honorable Prime Minister unveiled the statue of Lasit Barpukani Jorhat, which is beyond again Kaziranga. With the visit of Honorable Prime Minister, it already has become a tourism hotspot. The people definitely go and see. Saraido, that is the inclusion of Saraido in the World Heritage Center and coming there is definitely will get more tourist footfall in Saraido also. It is beyond Kaziranga. So, you can see this tourism is not confined to just two uh, sites, but it is beyond that as per the statistics and efforts are also there to make other place also in the tourism map.